Assalamualaikum and a very good morning. Today we will continue our lecture about engineering mechanics. So, equilibrium of rigid body in two dimension. Describe the concept of rigid body in engineering practice. Identify the difference between particle and rigid body. I draw the diagram that reflect existing force by applying free body diagram concepts. So, the force system using concept of rigid body equilibrium. Introduction. Concept. Rigid body is idealized extended solid whose size and shape are definitely fixed and remain unaltered when force are applied. A body which is currently stationary will remain stationary if the resultant force and resultant moment are zero for all the forces and couple apply on it so this is the important point okay about the concept of uh, digit body eh? moment are zero for all the forces and couple apply on it okay resultant force and resultant moment okay difference between particle and rigid body equilibrium of particles equilibrium of rigid body okay made up from one point has no dimension like a point in general ge geometry summation of f equal to zero summation of f y equal to zero this is called equilibrium in particle equilibrium of rigid body can be any shape dimension is very important the equation is fx summation of fx equal to zero, summation of fy equal to zero, summation of moment equal to zero. You can see this is this is a particle at one point. This is rigid body, many points. Okay. So procedure of analysis first free body diagram. Draw an outline shape of the body. Establish the x and y coordinate. Show all the forces acting on the body. Label all the loading and specify their direction. Indicate the dimension of the body. Equation of equilibrium. Moment equation. Summation of moment equal to zero. Force equation. Summation of effect equal to zero. And summation of y equal to zero. If the solution yield as a negative result scalar, the set is opposite. To that, what assume on the free body diagram. So the process of solving rigid body equilibrium problem for analyzing an actual physical system. Create an idealized model separate from the surrounding. Draw a free body diagram and showing all the external, active and reactive forces. Apply the equation of equilibrium for any unknown. So here you can see the physical system, idealized model, and then. So you might make sure this is hinge. So then you put the forces. Okay, support reaction. If the support reaction prevent the transition of body in a given direction, then a force is developed on the body in that direction. If the reaction is prevented, a couple of moment is exerted on the body. Consider the three way of way a horizontal member beam is supported at the end. Roller, cylinder, rocker, smooth surface, pinch. Hinge, fixed support, and cable. Okay, this is roller. Roller, you see roller. Roller, you can see the roller. Okay. Oh. Roller. Okay. Roller. They only have one force. Roller, cylinder, rocker, smooth contact surface. Prevent the beam from translating in the vertical direction. Can only exert a force on the beam in the vertical direction so this is the force only one force okay roller pinch or hinge this pin is pin or hinge you can see at the shopping complex or or, or other buildings okay pinch and hinge the pin hinge passes through a hole in the beam and two leaves that are fit to the ground prevent Transition of the beam in any direction, the pin hinge exert a force F on the beam in this direction. So you can see pins. 
they have a uh, if you convert to the PVD diagram they have uh, resultant force here is resultant force this is the uh, the angle or they have two forces Fx and Fy okay okay uh, fixed support fixed support you can see fixed support uh. you can see fixed support and then uh, fixed support you can see uh, they have uh, this support prevent cross transition and rotation of the beam the couple moment must develop on the beam on its point of connection force is usually represented in x and y component so this f fx fy and then they have a moment fixed support cable you can see cable cable this cable eh? cable cable the uh, pin and bridge yeah? cable cable the direction is a tension force which act away from the members in the direction of cable eh? this is the direction of cable they have a one force and they have a angle so example determine the horizontal and vertical component of the direction with the beam load a is a rocket b is a uh, pin neglect the weight eh? okay this is rocker rocker can rocket rocker eh? rocker roller 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 this is a pin Roller, there must be a one uh, forces pin. They have two F A and F Y, so we can see the answer. So this roller, so uh, they have a A Y. They have B X and B Y. They have two support. Six hundred newton force is represented by it X and Y component. Two hundred newton force act on the beam at the at B and is independent of the force component. B A and B Y represent the effect of the pin on the beam. A Y represent the effect of the rocker on the beam. Okay. You can see yeah, how to solve so, so the problem. You must uh, summation of x to zero. So you must uh, take all the x as this uh, force. For example, six cos seven cos forty five minus B X, and then you can get a B X. So I'm sure FY equal to 0. So uh, FY is here. Vertical force. You can see. Uh, so I'm sure of moment at B equal to 0. They have so many forces here. So we choose this. And if we choose a moment at B, we can we just ignore the force at B. So you can get the AY. So solution. Okay, example here. The link is connected at A and has a smooth support at B. Compute the horizontal and vertical component of the direction at pin A. This is pin A. Pin, eh? pin. Okay, this, uh, you can see this. This uh, fair force is moment. Eh? So, so uh, solution. We take the moment at A because there are so many force that we unknown force. So better we take this. So uh, NB NB is uh, 90 uh, Newton meter minus 660 Newton times 1 okay, this one 60 Newton times 1 which is uh, this is a uh, 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 you consider is a uh, clockwise is positive so my uh, this is uh, uh, you consider this counterclockwise is positive wrong counterclockwise is positive counterclockwise is positive yeah. counterclockwise is positive counterclockwise is positive yeah. counterclockwise is positive so 90 newton is a clockwise so negative 60 uh, Newton uh, to the point of A you can see Contact, uh, clockwise is negative plus N times 0 0.75 and you consider it counterclockwise okay okay is a positive then you can get the NB so let me show you to 0 AX Minus 200 
200 sin 30 200 you can get this from this 200 AX equal to 100 return so we have y equal to 0 AY minus 60 Newton minus 200 cos 30 Newton so you can get this okay for well, example 3 the ball wrench is used to straighten the ball at A if the wrench does not turn when the load is applied to the handle determine the torch of or moment applied to the bull and the force of the wrench on the bull so wrench so first step we need to do the free body diagram this is the free body diagram you can see they have moment at a they have a uh, aox ay and then this the moment summation of ma equal to zero so ma because there's so many unknown force Okay, MA we can consider. Uh, okay, okay, MA minus 52, MA minus uh, 52, 12 per, 12 per 13. 12 is 12 per 13. Okay, times N, 0 0.3, 30 sin 60, 30 sin 3 this year. Uh, 30 sin 30 sin 60 times 0 0.7 0 0.4 plus 0 0.3 so MA is so here uh, so here we consider the uh, counter clockwise is positive ok so uh, MA this one is uh, 52 52 12 per, uh, times 12 over 13 times 0 0.3 consider consider is a uh, clockwise this also this one also consider a uh, clockwise okay then you can get this summation of fx to 0 ax take this so you get 52 52 5 over 13 5 over 13 52 5 here eh, over 13 so the the force is here so negative plus 30 cos 60 so plus ok plus eh, 30 cos 60 ax equal to 5 so go same goes to the ay ok ok problem 4 this uniform truck ram has a weight of 160 new, thousand, uh, newton and its speed to the body of the truck at each end held in the position by two side cable determine the tension in the cable so you can see uh, determine the tension here so the tension here the tension to the cable eh? so we make a free body diagram ax ay t and then this is the answer summation of ma eh? so you can see here there is a lot of uh, Unknown forces we make a, a, a moment at A, so we must to get the uh, uh, the value of T. So T cost cost twenty. That means T cost twenty is uh, here. Uh, T cost twenty. T here T here T. Uh, this 20, this 90, 90 degree. Okay. Uh, no, no. Uh, this T is here. T. Uh, T. This T. Okay. You can see. Uh, T cos 20 cos 20 that mean t uh, uh, cos 20 here t cos 20 here this is t cos 20 ok cos 20 so uh, uh, times 2 sin 30 2 times 2 sin 30 0.15 plus Plus uh, one five five is uh, 
uh, to sin 30 30 is from here to here so okay so you can get this okay t sin 20 2 cos 30 that's 1600 1.5 cos 30 sin you get the value of t so since there are two cable so you must divide it by 2 okay the mean direction of a b and c so you can see a b and c this roller this is roller this hinge you can see the free body diagram so a roller so you can see the answer uh, summation of mc equal to 0 summation of f x equal to 0 summation of fy equal to 0 